Well, all right, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Citizens of YouTube, Pastor Dow here again. You know, I'm thinking about this assassination attempt on President Trump, right? And as I sit and start meditating and thinking about this, I need to think about this. You need to think about this. And again, it proves one thing that is definitely true. Law enforcement can't protect you. The Secret Service can't protect you. Only you can protect you. And if even if that, you're out there on the campaign and, and you're out there uh, ministering, preaching, teaching, um, whatever they call that stuff, having rallies, pep talks or whatever it is, whatever the president does up there, is, he talks about many different subjects. And um, even at that, you can't even protect yourself at that point in juncture. So President Donald Trump has allegedly the best so-called security in the world. And I sit there and watch the woman, three of them on detail, I sit up and watch the woman struggle to put her firearm back in a holster. I saw them dropping stuff. I, I, I said, it looks like a disaster. And what kind of people did they pick for this selected service? And, what, and who is it? And who are they trained by? Because it looks sloppy. When I sit back, I must watch that video. I can't tell you at least 10, 15 times. Extremely sloppy. But then all of that, when you start getting more details, that this guy was less than 200 meters, 200 yards from the president. There was no more than three or four buildings that a, a man could possibly be there on a rooftop. And this guy's on a rooftop with a with a rifle, got off five shots, end up killing uh, someone, and got a, a hit on the president. This is bad. And then they sit up there and thank the Secret Service for what? They didn't protect you, President Donald Trump. They didn't at all in any way, shape, fashion, or form. I mean, everybody knows you check. Everybody knows. I ain't going to say everybody knows. But that security detail, I mean, they were saying that people, civilians in the audience was pointing at the guy, hollering and screaming and trying to tell them, but they wasn't listening. That's why I'm telling you, man. Things are looking extremely shady on this. Extremely shady. So, Second Amendment proves to be right again. Even if you're the former president of the United States of America, you can't, look, law enforcement cannot protect you. You can only protect yourself. And even at that, um, it's very slim if you don't know where the attack is coming. It's one thing when the attack is in front of you. Again, 2A all the way. Better get some firearms. Better carry your weapon. You better carry your weapon with you because you don't get to pick the day, time, or hour when evil comes your way.